Hey gang, Jack Lair here, and we are continuing to play through Skyrim. Uh, this is my second week, and I have turned off survival mode. We're gonna play with some fire arrows. A little over his head, but that's fine. Um, I have been having a blast still playing this. And basically I've set some uh, kind of goals for myself. Sorry, Lydia. And, oh, there we go. Oh, a little short. But basically what I'm trying to do is uh, a handful of things, one of which is to get all of the enchantments which I'll be working on uh, later. And I'm kind of going through and doing quest by quest. Now I'm playing a thief character, or a rogue, and I am more or less terrible at it. I occasionally dabble into destruction. Come on. Sorry, I have a blast with this. Um, I also run out of mana in a second. But some of these fights have been going uh, really well, so they have been going absolutely terrible. And I learned that you can milk the goat. I worked uh, over this week to get all of the, the pets. Um, but this is something that I was missing with the smithing enchanting. So I managed to find that from our good buddy Belathor. And a little bit later, I'm going to actually uh, manage to screw up my ability to come in this room. Or at least I think I'm still not allowed there. But... Eh. I uh, decided to bring uh, Meridia's Beacon. Uh, because I know that I am also trying to get the achievements. Which is why I'm not playing with any mods. And I know that the Daedric artifacts are needed. Uh, I haven't been to Solitude yet, to so go? had to take a carriage. Climb and back, and we'll be off. First time in Solitude? Beautiful old city. Capital of Skyrim. I love that he's like a weird little guide. Yep, that's a dragon. I don't know what I managed to do, but the dragons show up everywhere in this game, and I haven't even gone up to the the graybeards yet, so they're just they just show up. Sometimes like that they completely ignore me. Look at my temple lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals, their crafts and their hearts. Restore to me my beacon, that I might guide you toward your destiny. Oh. Hi, Lydia. That beam hurts us. Not a lot, but I never paid attention before. Okay, so this is the guy that we need to take down. So we'll just sneak up. Uh. Uh. Oh, they all noticed Lydia. <laughs> Alright, so, uh. There we go. I have retrieved Dawnbreaker. Which I have to say is uh, still one of the coolest looking weapons. It's fairly straightforward, but it has that nice glow to it. Looks really weird in an Argonian hands, though. Come on, Lydia. Come on. And she is in. I've been looking for. Hey, you. the courier. That's something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Okay, I am way up in the mountains. Uh, the f oh, you're still here. Okay. I love that the blacksmithing forge you can use to kind of teleport around. It's not a quick way to move, but it gets you to the other side. All right. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostility. I love that hostility. that's what he wakes up to tell us about. Papa, you're back. Why, yes, I am. Could you give me an allowance? Uh, what? Oh no. Boosh! 
This is my home. And the dragon still showed up. upgraded here. A little bit more armor on that. And I'm now 100 smithing. This is because of the uh, all of the glitching that I did earlier. I've got your back. So I just kind of ended up with this. So yeah, smithing is now. So we're going to go ahead and reset this because basically anytime I upgrade a piece of armor, this automatically takes me back to 100 or really close. So I basically just started making uh, iron daggers and then going poof. And then I level up a lot. But another achievement, master, which means I hit level 50. So I decided to start going, uh, equipping her in the ebony armor because I think that that looks really awesome. Uh, managed to uh, make some gauntlets as well. Upgrade those and now she's looking a little cooler in my Lead opinion. On. So for the ebony armor is the one that I like the most on her. Uh, I do end up also making some dragon scale armor. That's for me for later uh, because I don't think... Uh, so Argonians look weird in most armor to me and i don't know what armor to go with for my argonian oh hey here's the campsite from uh from when i was in survival mode cool cave full of trolls i really should not be using fire arrows but i love that i fire an exploding arrow and the frost troll is still like, Oop. I don't know. I don't know who's attacking me. And yes, I'm kind of defaulting into stealth archer, which is just kind of what always happens. I really need to play an entire... Is there a mod that just takes bows out of the game? Maybe that's how I should have to play. That would finally get me to do that. Uh, I'll start using my woodcutting hatchet because why not? Oh no. <laughs> but we got him. Oh that's a dao. That's a death lord. That is a trap. Okay. So I just happen to have uh pots? No. None of these are pick upable pots. So hey, you're pick upable. And you set off traps. This'll work. I hope. Maybe. I don't remember if this worked or not. Oh, there we go. We set it off. And now we just leave him on the trigger? Nope. He slid off. Put that on. Nope. There we go. Perfect. Cool. Yeah, I nearly died. I nearly died a lot. I think I did yeah. die a lot. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this guy. Pardon? Pardon? I don't remember his name, but... It took me a few tries to get him. And now we've got marked for death. This is a delightful shout that I've had fun using. Kaboom! Nope, nobody here. 
Time to work on some skills. Work on some light armor here. I can't believe I made that shot. All right, where'd he go? Oh, somebody sneaking around. Nope, that's Lydia. Lydia, help. No? Alright, there we go. I'm on your side. Are you Lucky hit. Yeah. Lydia decided to just start stealing my kills halfway through this. Oh, there's a boat. There's a frost. Wait. Oh no. Yeah, that's that's gonna be bad. I'll just sneak around, sneak around here, and then I'll get the drop on them. Lydia! It's nothing. I forget that as an Argonian I can just swim underwater. This is kind of an underwhelming thing, but I got uh, some barnacles. Come on, mud crab. Skill game. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Lydia, once again, stealing my kills. Where'd the wolf go? Oh, I can get him. Healing. Uh, Lydia, once again. All right. Let's finish off our armor, or at least get more pieces going. Get some boots for her. Take a look. Uh, I'm pretty sure that do not delete is not supposed to be there. I think I may slowly just be breaking the game. All right, we got some more uh, enchants more enchants. I uh, basically did a uh, shopping run of just running around to everybody and looking and seeing what I could get to fill them in. I also printed out uh, an actual physical checklist so that as I'm going through here I can mark off what I've got and what I don't have so that I don't have to uh, really pay as much attention. I can just look down at the piece of paper and be like, aha, I'm missing this. I will. Oh! Yeah, I forgot. So I got a. Uh, what is it? Trap hole? Trap hole. And uh, this is apparently how you get conjuration. You just cast it over and over again. And it works even on a dead thing. So I'm gonna get my conjuration up because. There's a broken thing that I've been summoning. Look, Papa, I made a new friend. Could I, I mean, keep I can't him? really. Please. What am I gonna say? I'm out there bringing spiders and skeevers and who knows what else. Thanks. Yep, there's a little fox. All right, building the. Ebony shield. So that now she'll have a shield. Give that a little buff. Hand it to her. And. You lead, I'll follow. Amazing. Oh, this mage showed up and was like, I want a duel! And then totally aced me. I did not stand a chance. And I had not quick saved, so it took me a while. Uh, I had never come in the basement of here. But there are places for a whole bunch of the different things, and I think I've got one in the, the, the next week upcoming. But I instantly was like, oh, this is where all the claws go. Just like, oh, oh wait, I know where one of those are. 
I don't know where they all are, but I'm actually going to learn this time. Because normally I use them and then I just kind of throw them to the side. But I know there's one still in Riverwood. So we'll just uh, let ourselves in. Don't mind me. Okay, you go upstairs. And I'll just, uh... You need to leave. Oh. Camilla? You need to leave. Oh. Yeah, what if I go over here? Oh. You need to leave. Now yeah, she can't see me. Mission accomplished. All right, and we'll set this down here. Because this claw, I don't know. I, I want to get them all, but man, that's going to be a lot. Dawnbreaker, wait. I have Dawnbreaker upstairs. Aha! Okay, 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 okay. And boom. Look at that. Why are we here? Oh, there's an enemy nearby. Oh! It's an ancient dragon. This is the third dragon at my house, and I'm dead. Okay, round two. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. Round three. I actually think there were like five rounds to this. Hide over here. You're home. Did you bring me anything? Yes. You got me a present? Really? Yes, here's an apple dumpling. Thanks. You're welcome. I really wish there was more to that. Witches? Nah. Pass. We're looking for a spider. Do a barrel roll. Wait, no. Barrel rolls the other way. Is it? No, I forgot. That's a lot of legs. I hear a lot of legs moving. Yeah, me too, Lydia. Oh, look! Man, they look angry. So, each of these pets does something, and I don't know what some of them do. Like, I know the goat can carry a whole lot, so you can give them uh, uh, a bunch of stuff to carry. Kaboom! Uh, but, like, the... The the notes of some of them say something, because normally there's a there's a book around with ah. pets. And I haven't figured out what they do yet. Ow. I'm an eight shot. Uh, by the way, I've uh, probably died many more times than what you've seen in this video, and that will continue, because I'm... What the... Oh. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. The pets travel in real time. So when you send them away... All right. Sneak. Awesome. Hey. So this is where I think I might have uh, angered a bunch of people. It's I try and free the prisoner. Yeah. He's a storm cloak, and I'm a storm cloak. At least I think I am. I was given a storm cloak your ass, so. Yeah, and as always, uh, this is how you mountain climb. Oh, hey. What are you folks doing? What you want, huh? Whoa, 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 whoa. That was hostile. Must have run off. Hey, friend. Okay. This is, uh, Probably one of my favorite dudes. My favorite summons. So for every person that it kills, uh, for every animal as well, it then spawns a ghost of that person. Uh, to include, uh, that's another dragon. Spoilers, this one doesn't go well either.
but while uh, everybody else is being distracted, I managed to just grab this one, which I believe is the second power of that. But uh, it does not end well. And of course, I didn't save for a great long while, so I had to go all the way back to for the treasure hunters, the two nice ladies in the middle of the river, and had to wander all the way back here and start this fight again. Yeah. Uh, and then I remember to actually save on the way here. That is not a lot of health. Oh. I don't know what I'm doing here. I think I'm just learning all the... Yeah, okay. I'm just going through and looking for anything that's unknown. And then eating it. Because I'm trying to get to the tamed rabbit. There it is. Thistle. Hi, Thistle. Hey, buddy. Are you hungry? Well, we all know rabbits like carrots, even though they don't really like carrots. Uh, or carrots are not the best thing for... Just uh, take the little... Uh, take the carrot here, buddy. Nope. Okay. Let's uh, read a note. Aha! The note will tell me that I should give a carrot to a rabbit. There we go. All right, let's see. Let's get some illusion. Uh, Two-handed attack. Muffling, which I believe only goes on boots. And then magical resistance, which if I remember right, can only go up to 85%, even though I can get it to uh, eight bajillion or whatever weird numbers I'm working on. This entertained me for way too long. I just kept summoning, summoning it so that the other one would die. Alright, Gloom Reach. What could possibly go wrong? I love this. The whole look of this place was just cool. It had the lighting going. I mean, lighting that it could have going from that, from what, 12 years ago? Oh, I know that noise. Oh, dodge! Oh. I'll kill you if I Lydia, have no, that's our... Lydia? What are you doing? Calm down. Calm down. Lydia is too powerful for calm. Okay. I'll kill you if I have to. Lydia, that's Hilda. That's our friend. We don't hit the pets. Ugh, I feel like I'm talking to my kids. You just you go home. You go wait for me. Now you'll pay. Okay. Bye bye. No, Lydia. I don't know what her name is. Of course, Lydia. Knock him off the cliff. Alright. Unlock the door with the spider. Wait, didn't we already do a spider? Oh, yeah, this is not a pet. Job me. All right. Oh, hit the post. <laughs> Lydia hit the post too. <laughs> All right. Oh, we got it through. This is the dumbest fight ever. Good job, Lydia. Okay. No, nope. Lydia. Oh, hi! <laughs> you scared the crap out of me. Why are you moonwalking? Where are you going? What the? 
Oh. Alright, we gotta go get him. Alright. Lydia, cover me. I'm just gonna sneak around here. Nobody sees me yet. Okay, good job. Good job. We got it. We got it. Nope. We don't got it. Alright. Oh. I'll save you. That fight didn't go well. But we made it out. Yay. Enough. It's such a lead up to such an underwhelming. I gotta say that the... Just looking around the Skyrim is still a lot of fun. Oh, the Briar Hearts. These guys are jerks. Some silver ore. Always good to have. Bard's Leap Summit. Ready? Maybe they're friendly? Oh! Nope, not friendly. Alright, let's get this. See what I didn't notice was the briar thorn sitting there, or the briar heart, and that hurt. Hi. Oh, nope. Lydia? God. Alright. Just gonna shoot the pistol. Third time's charm. First try. Every time. Okay. Oh, I did this on while I was playing with mods, so I am not gonna go in there right now. Instead, we're going to finish Lydia's armor by giving her the helmet. At least I think this is the last one. Did I already Lead give her the boots? Follow. Yeah, I did. All right. Frost suppression. Rejuvenation. All right. So we're doing good. We are knocking out enchantments. We're getting those. We've got most of the pets. We're moving on. I may have lost a drop or two of blood. Truth is, I'm not going anywhere like this. <laughs> Thank you. Please hurry. <laughs> I love how he went from I'm dying to Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank better. you, sir. Thanks, friend. I wouldn't have lasted much longer without that. Oh. Okay, so I learned something interesting is that especially when you're dealing with uh, the enchantments sneak attack on a bear be careful but uh so enchantments on Justice, on weapons especially ones that. with charges look I if want you, you to have this I know it isn't much but it's screw it up to into the bajillions range first uh, it doesn't together. work quite right Always anymore broader luck you should be the one to carry it now I'll give them a proper burial then head back Come find me if you're ever in Falkreath. You'll always be welcome at my door. Okay, I left this in here because I gotta remember that Falkreath is his thing. Hunter's Rest. Oh. Hunter's sleeping. Okay, Hunter's resting. Got it. Checks out. <gasps> Sweet roll. I'm, I absolutely love that they introduced an amount of 
lore into this that a bosmer is like hey the the bosmer can train the wild animals and he gives he gives the wild animal the fox to this guy and then this guy's like i'm gonna go try and tame some wolves and the wolves murder him so you know that's how that goes kind of and i'd have a wolf at my heels uh, I managed to find a nice conjuration book along Did the way. you see a dog out there? Climb and back and we'll be off. Oh, and now we're going to Riften. If you've never been to Riften, be sure to visit the Blackbriar Meadery. Hold there. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitor's tax. Um, did you hear that? Riften is entering the city. What does yeah, it there's a little red dot. No, no, we gotta, we gotta pick this up. I think you'd be a little smarter than that. All right, keep your voice down. You want everyone keep to hear you? Down. How will they hear us over the screaming? Oh, thank goodness, he got to the gates and locked part. Boom. Yeah, no waste of the fire arrow, but oh. where's my skeleton doing? That's all you got. No. That's yep. Combat working as intended. Oh, he wants to see the door. I'll just open the door for you, guy. There you go. Wait, wait, ow! Oh, there we go. There's Scritch. Oh, this is the ghost thing. There's a super cool sword. Oh, you gotta fight guardians, and there's like a whole bunch of story behind it. It's actually kind of cool because basically this dude went absolutely insane. But the fun part is, is that they are were a blade. Are I mean, okay, so technically he's dead. Yeah, I managed to uh, actually go through and uh, disenchant some stuff in the middle of this dungeon, which was weird. Oh, sneak attack. Thank you. And so this is Blade's armor, and I have no I have no right to have this, but I decided that if I was gonna grab it, look, they're reunited. Aw. Alright. Speak the code phrase to this beggar. Oh, this is the start of the gray whatever thing. Oh, think? now that Maybe. can't be good. <laughs> Thank you. Here, this is for you. Here, I'll give you the key to my safety deposit box and my home. On this day, what? I go to Sovengard. Oh. Uh-oh. And that's it. Thank you very much for watching, and as always, play on.